Good evening, everyone. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Matt Breen. Jessica Bowman is off tonight. Cleanup continues tonight after severe weather did damage in several communities across Siouxland. The worst, though, appears to be in northeast Nebraska. Take a look at this picture from Plainview, Nebraska. What you're looking at is the roof that was torn off of the elementary school in the Pierce County town. Marie took this picture shortly after the storm swept through, which packed straight line winds. Now here is a closer look thanks to the school district superintendent. Look how that roof is folded up against the high school building after it was torn off the elementary school and thrown across the street. Now take a look from the air. Eric Berg put his drone in the air over the scene. Superintendent Darren Arlt tells KTIV around 530 tonight. The roof was blown off the east side of the elementary school and onto the high school building and several cars across the street. Arlt says the elementary building's original flat roof remains intact, but there was water damage to the elementary building. Arlt confirms no injuries tonight. Almost immediately, Arlt says people from the community turned up to help clean up the debris. An insurance company and a roofing company have now been called to provide temporary repairs to the roof in order to have the school open in time for most scheduled events tomorrow. Storms also did major damage in Wausau, Nebraska. Take a look at the pictures that Angie sent us. Large trees ripped out of the ground by the high winds. Now this next picture, pretty amazing. The man in the picture is Angie's husband, Dan. He's 5'11 and is dwarfed by the roots of this uprooted tree. Damage was also done to Tabor Lutheran Church. See there, that's the church's steeple. It's on the ground next to the church building. If you have pictures to share, simply send them to connect at KTIV.com. Don't include, don't forget to include your name and a description of what we see in that picture.